Hey, what's going on guys? Carolina Crappie here. Today, I'm gonna teach you how to tie a loop knot. It's very simple, I use it all the time. Uh, I crappie fish and that's what I use. So like, that's really the only knot that I use for crappie fishing. I love it, it gives the most action and it produces the, the most bites in my opinion. So we will meet over here. I'll get the chest cam on and show you how to tie this bad boy. Okay, here we are. We're about to show how it's done. I'm gonna do this loop knot. I'm gonna show you two of the same method. One to a big scale like right now, and another to a smaller scale using a jig and our mono or fluoro, whatever you wanna use. Okay. For this loop knot, just pass through like this. That's all we're doing. This is gonna be your tag end. So make sure you have plenty of room to make this knot. So I'm gonna exaggerate this knot for you so that you can see how much tag end I'm bringing. The reason for that is we're gonna make a loop with our fingers. So our index and middle finger, we're gonna wrap that line around, up and over, and then we've got a hole right here. We're gonna pass through that once twice. That's all I'm going to do. You can do more than that if you want. And I'm holding it with my finger right here so that you can watch that not cinch together. Boom. That's all there is to this knot. Very simple. We're done other than clipping the tag end. So I'll do that now. You can clip it super close if you want. It doesn't really matter. There it is. It's done. That's what it's going to look like. Beautiful. Now I'll show you to a smaller scale, like what you would use out on the water. Whenever I'm tying a crappie jig, it's pretty much the only knot I use. So same thing. It's just harder to see like this. Just want you to see what it looks like both ways. So I'm going to pass through once, twice, and then watch our knot cinch together. I'm pushing that knot close to the eye of the hook. Cinch down. Then clip the tag end. Tag end's clipped. And that jig is ready to move freely. Also, in this situation, when tying this knot, it helps that body, if you have like a paddle tail on the end as, as the body, it helps it to move and give better action. So that's all there is to it. Here's your two completed knots. Bam.